Yo, what's up, YouTube? Um, final video of the day. Getting tired. <laughs> and this video is going to be my favorite movie slash documentaries of 2022 that came out last year. So, let's start a list off. Um, at first, I would say Devil's Drop. If you guys know, don't know where I'm from, I'm South Africa. It's events that happened here, there were um, satanic killings or something, they got 24, 14 people, I can't remember, I can't really, really can't remember, but it was just such a good documentary, it was 4 episodes, sadly it was amazing, I would for sure recommend it. Um, next up on the list would be Halloween Kills, it was just such a good Halloween, it's like that's in Halloween 2018 because it's one movie. You know, but it was just such great movies, like the Halloween franchise, how they you know, are doing it now. So yeah, um, next up on the list is Juice World documentary Into the Best. It was a, such a good album. I have a documentary show. That uh, album same thing. But it was a good documentary. But my favorite documentary of all time, that and Devil's Drop, is two amazing documentaries. So just, it's not like a normal documentary. They don't talk to it. It's like a one week vlog of Juice. We just got cry a few times. Next up would be the Batman, the the new Batman with uh, Rob Patterson. It was amazing. I actually have it on my USB flash drive right now, guys. Uh, believe me, it's my USB flash drive. I downloaded it on there. I worked with my dad because he didn't have Wi-Fi or anything, so I downloaded my movies for him. So the Batman was just it was different. I think it's better than. Then. So I'm gonna get hate and shit off of this. I don't give a damn. <clears throat> but in my opinion. It's better than the Dark Knight. I like the Dark Knight franchise, but this one, The Batman, which is amazingly good. How they focused on the Batman and the Riddler, Killings, James Gordon, Catwoman. So it's like, oh, you know, it's a good movie in general. Um, my, f my favorite movie of 2022, Spider Man Now We're Home. It was, this is an insane Spider Man. Probably my favorite Spider Man movie of all time. Might be the best. The biggest movie, the best Marvel movie. Because when they brought back Toby and Angie, they were probably the amazed. But the best part, I actually cried in the movie when they swung together, the three. Spoilers if you guys haven't seen it. Most of the movie spoilers ahead. And they also brought back, where well, they killed out May. And brought back all the previous villains. And it's one of my, it's my favorite movie. Well, we would have just made the movie a little bit better if they brought back. Villain wasn't in the movie, but I just wish it was... You know, in the movie, you know, with the three Spider Man, it should be too much. I mean, people say it's too much. I don't give a shit. It's great. I love it. It's great. So, if you guys didn't enjoy this video, this is my final video. I'm actually tired from you. I just filmed like five or six videos in a row. So, if you guys didn't enjoy this video, peace out.